Jason. How the hell did you get in here? How did we get here? The same way I escaped. Go to hell. I'm almost confident I will. Escape. What do you want? To get to know you. Well, my favorite breakfast food is pancakes. I occasionally enjoy playing tennis, and I really like killing psychotic bastards like you. <laughs> do you think killing me is going to get you anywhere? It pulls the incessant thorn out of my side. <laughs> Do you really think you can beat me? I know I can. We shall see. You make one move while I move, and I'll kill you. That is the poison pawn. The player puts his pawn in the middle of the board in plain sight, putting the opponent into a false sense of security until his pawn is also taken. Remind you of anyone? I cannot use these three middle fingers, because I just have to use this one. The tendons in my hand have been severed. I can no longer use my ring, middle, or index finger. You poor man. You must be so misjudged. You used to be a run-of-the-mill serial killer. Why have you joined an assassin organization? That organization's just a ploy to attract the more... Unstable minds. I don't actually share their endgame, but their means satisfy my ends. But what about you, Jason? Your little organization pulls people out of ruined homes and families. Evidently, they make the best agents. What ruined your family? <sighs> my dad left when my brother and I were kids. It's common, you know. Dad's leaving. After that, my mom fell into depression. She started drinking. My brother started doing drugs. One day I came home from school. My mom and brother were fighting, arguing. Pots were thrown. Finally, my brother left. I was an only child living with my mom. That's it? Everyone left? Pathetic, really, if you ask me, but... A month or two later, my brother broke in. He murdered my mom in her sleep. I watched. I let him. And I got one of the kitchen knives and I killed him. Right there. That's what happened.
because that puts a new perspective on you. So you lived through a hell. Not very impressive, but at least now I understand. I'll stop you and your organization. Do you honestly think you can outsmart me? Checkmate. I just did. Insane, Crow! Insane! Insane! No. No, I'm not insane. Do you want to know what the definition of insanity is? Insanity is doing the exact same thing. Over and over again, expecting some change. That is insanity. It took me a long time to figure out. I fell off it while contemplating why I do the things I do. And then, I saw, everywhere I looked, these fools saying, This time, it's going to be different. Honestly, it will! Do you think I'm lying, Jason? We both know that's beneath me. And ever since I joined this little group, I've been trying to find the same goddamn information and kill the same three people over and over again. And did I tell you what the definition of insanity is? I've been called many things. Evil, murderer, thief, but never, never have I been called insane. I'm not, I'm not the only one fighting you. Whatever your goal is, you can't win. Goal? My goal in life is to not have any goals. Ignorant fools like you set yourselves up for failure. With such high expectations, how can any of you hope to find happiness? With no goals, I can't lose. <sighs> Do you want me to kill you? I won't. I'm not that shallow. I'm not going to be keeping you around for some personal enjoyment of mine. Believe it or not, I respect you. So, you can try and stop me. But be prepared for failure, Jason. 